My name is Michael Mastro. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Rusty Creations. Today, we're going to look at the chart for uh, speaker uh, Kevin McCarthy. Um, if you look to the eastern horizon when he was born, you would see the constellation associated with Taurus rising at 11 degrees. First, we'll look and see how the planets are operating and when they're operating and, and what could be done to strengthen the chart. So uh, sun is ruling the house of happiness through home life. It's placed in the house of uh, good fortune and government and politics, belief systems. Um, so sun gives happiness through uh, service to the government and uh, moon is... Uh, rules the house of success and is placed in that house of income. So his uh, success and income come through serving the public. Moon is public. Challenging Mars. Mars is um, any multicona sign in the 6th, 8th, or the 12th house. And in a Taurus uh, chart, it's all three. Um, the uh, uh, signs found in those houses, uh, their rulers become challenging. So Mars uh, is challenging and can create losses and expenses, but does give the ability to take on different roles in government. Uh, then weak placement, old Mercury. Mercury, any more a planet that's more than 25 degrees has trouble uh, promoting its own significations. And so uh, Mercury is uh, ruling the house of creativity and it's placed in the house of uh, obstacles, challenges, vulnerabilities. So uh, uh, Mercury um, uh, gives a speech that's controversial. So they say he tries to please everyone and and pleases no one so uh then we have challenging jupiter jupiter is ruling the house of obstacles so uh, uh giving some obstacles to his government roles it's sitting in the ninth house of government and uh it brings some vulnerability to what he believes um and then uh, we have Venus is challenging. Uh, it's uh, Libra in the sixth house. Again, can uh, is ruled by Venus. So Venus is uh, bringing some setbacks to his income, sitting in the house of income, and uh, and uh, to his relationships, his partnerships in the um, uh, government. And then we have a uh, weak infant state. Um, Saturn, any planet that's less than three degrees has trouble uh, promoting its own significations. So uh, Saturn rules the house of career and uh, gives career through government service with some ups and downs. Then we have challenging Rahu and K2, always opposite each other, balancing something. So Rahu's in the first house. So he's trying to balance his personal needs with the needs of others. K2's in the house of others. Now let's look at the timing of events. Became a representative um, 2002 to 2006 uh, during a moon period, moon bringing some success. Then there was rumors of an affair in 2005, so it kind of dropped his bid. That's during a K2 period, bringing uh, K2 is sitting in the house of uh, relationships, um, so bringing unexpected events. Uh, then we have 2009 to 11. Uh, he's again re uh, House of Representatives during a Sun period. Sun period uh, uh, bringing uh, some happiness and in, in terms of being a leader, leadership. And then he became the uh, House Whip in 2014 during a Rahu period, and. Um, Rahu, you know, bringing, uh, sitting in his house of life purpose, and then became majority leader in a uh, sun period. 
um, again, bringing the leadership skills. There was an investigation into his brother-in-law, um, uh, the funds he received for government contracts during uh, 2018, during a Jupiter period, Jupiter bringing some obstacles, challenges. And then um, he became um, a speaker in 2023, uh, beginning of the 23, um, after 15 uh, votes. Um, so it was a narrow margin. And then he was ousted on October 3rd, 2023, uh, during a Venus Mercury period. So uh, Venus is ruling the house of losses. And uh, you can see in the, the chart to the left, the circular chart, the outer circle is where the planets were on that day. The inner circle is where, where the planets were when he was born. And you can see that um, Mars and K2 were afflicting each other in the house uh the sixth house of conflict so totally conflict um uh when he was ousted um, creating a lot of uh, stress what could be done to strengthen the chart well charity work i think his service to the government is helping some of that and then my favorite remedy is a kavash to strengthen his benefic planets if you'd like to see or order a kavash or a reading or learn Vedic astrology, you can go to www.vastucreations.com. Thank you so much for listening, and we wish him well.